So one of the big questions coming into this work was whether performance assessment systems could work um, in all kinds of school contexts. We've seen and we have lots of examples of small schools that do this work. Um, and here in Oakland, we actually have examples of large schools that have also embraced performance assessment work and are doing it really well. Uh, and so it's not just something that works in small or medium-sized schools, but really can work in the comprehensive school setting. Um, to be real, it's a much bigger challenge because you have more adults and more people competing for the vision and the direction of the school. But when you can get a school of that size organized and focused around a common vision um, for what students should be able to do by the time they graduate, it's a very powerful thing for the school. And the teachers that we work with at Oakland High who are, I think, leading this work in, in terms of our comprehensive schools, they say that the shift that the students have experienced, because now the students are all being held to the same expectations and the deadlines are falling on the same dates, that they don't complain about the capstone project in the way that they used to. They see it as something that's integral to the school uh, and they see it as part of the fabric of what it is to be a student at Oakland High. Um, and so it's really important that in these school settings that people are really collaborating and focused on, on a common vision and, and create a system that supports that vision.